my topic for to, uh, today is quizy and uh, everyone here has talked about digitali digitalization artificial intelligence teaching learning but i wanted to talk about but when we are using so many of apps for the students to learn how we how will we know that they are learning well or they are getting what we are telling them or we are teaching them so for that <coughs> i thought that the best way is to assess them using the digital equipments only using the digital methods only this will be a fun for them also and for us also because we all know we all are here that evaluation is not that easy for us and that and that is not very fun for us we feel bored at times when we are evaluating the students and we sometimes uses our own you know biasness for doing that so why not we are using the same kind of digital equipments or this kind of ai hands for assessment also so there is one tool which i have you know come through and most of the people in different universities especially in delhi university they are using this tool for their students to make them to engage them in this uh, assessment so this is quizy and this is very popular this is actually come with quizy and kahoot but the mostly people use is quizy because it's easy to use it is easy for the for us to share and send to the students also so uh, i will not waste time here by just showing you the ppts i will tell you how we'll make a quiz fatafat and then we can send it to the students with the help of the google classrooms or with the help of the codes we can give them they can enter the code like we do use in the our atm they use the code and the quiz will get open we can give the deadlines to them they can use it before this we are using it it was using used by different schools they were using for their for their students but now the university especially the professional courses they are using this app okay so let's start here as you will go for the quizy you will just go to the google write quizy there and you this page will get open okay and on this page you there is a when it will open they will ask you to log in please log in with your gmail account or if you have your students or any google classroom aligned then it is better to use that email id only because ultimately whatever you make you have to send it to your students now this is dr yamini ke naam se you can see that i have already logged in then there is a option come here called create create pe jaiye aur quiz likha hua aayega lessons bhi bana sakte hain hum quiz banate hain quiz mein hum do options we can see here use automatic builder or create from the scratch better to create it from here now there are lots of questions are also there quizzes are also already there on the quiz which people are worldwide making and storing it in the library like for example i wanted to uh, you know write about or i wanted to have a quiz about the advertising theek hai so what i'll do is aap upar dekh rahe ho teleport likha hua hai yahan par aap jaise isko click karenge it will come now you can सर्च यो आप इधर ऊपर में इधर एडवर्टाइजिंग लिखती हूँ एंड देन आई हैव टू चूज द ग्रेड मैं ये के जी से लेकर इट इज टिल यूनिवर्सिटी एंड प्रोफेशनल डेवलपमेंट आई कैन गो फॉर द यूनिवर्सिटी यो एंड यू कैन सी द लॉर्ड्स ऑफ क्विजेज आई यो एंड इट्स नॉट इंडिया एंड इट्स नॉट इंटरनेशनल इट्स वर्ल्ड वाइड पीपल आर यूजिंग इट एंड दे आर सेविंग इट इन दिस लाइब्रेरी सो यू विल गेट गुड नंबर ऑफ क्वेश्चन you can open something and you can see there are lot of questions here theek hai so you can take examples of these questions for example now i want to create my own quiz and i want that mujhe ye wala question acha lag raha i want to add it in my quiz add question kariye it will go here fir hum koi aur isme se questions dekh lete hain hame kuch aur acha bhi lag raha hai for example i like this ki ye kiska logo hai we all know add question and then it will go here now यहाँ पे मैंने बना लिया नाउ हियर आई वांट दैट आई शुड एड माय ओन क्वेश्चंस सो क्रिएट अ न्यू क्वेश्चन इट विल आस्क यू यू वांट मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चंस यू वांट मैच यू वांट ड्रैग एंड ड्रॉप आप कुछ रीऑर्डर करना चाहते हैं और अदरवाइज यू कैन हैव द ऑडियो एंड वीडियो रिस्पॉन्सेज एज वेल यू कैन एड ऑडियो एंड वीडियो ऑल्सो हियर आप मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन में यू कैन गो यू कैन राइट यू हैव राइट हियर आप इसके यहाँ पे चार ऑप्शन दे दीजिए ओके okay. मैं यहाँ पे कुछ भी लिख देती हूँ लाइक like मैं यहाँ पे कुछ और दे देती हूँ 
एनीथिंग आई विल राइट हेयर एंड एनीथिंग आई कैन राइट हेयर आल्सो और दिस इज़ द राइट आंसर मैं इसको ओके okay करूँगी एंड आई विल मेक इट मैं इसमें एक टाइम भी दे सकती हूँ कि स्टूडेंट शुड डू इट इन थर्टी सेकेंड्स थर्टी सेकेंड्स बाद ही हट जाएगा एंड देन आई कैन सेव इट like this we can add and we can make so many assignments like this and then one will do it we'll going to save this kuch bhi naam isko hum de dete hain add to karke de diya maine and see visibility aap kahan chahte hain aap sirf chahte hain aapko dikhe or you want the other people can see you can do it like this confirm and save and continue now you want to have a start quiz either you give your students a code for it they will opt for that that code and it will start or you can assign a homework like this or aap isko assign kar sakte hain again you can share a deadlines here you want that aap isko deadline do din mein din din mein jaise you want to give it you can give it accordingly and then you can send it to your students here aap apne students ko assign kar sakte hain iske andar you can assign them through the classes like i have told you for example i have already made this class my class bgmc i have opted it now i have go for the next i will add the time and everything or i can give them a deadline here and then i can save and it will go it will pop up to the students in their google classroom they can use it and i have set a deadline here so after the deadline it will get over i must tell you that most of the ftps which we are attending nowadays in different universities are using quizzes for us to evaluate we get the we get evaluations done and then we get our certificates is it right or wrong this is all done through quiz only this is how the people are working in different universities for the ftps also and this is how we can make the interaction with the students more in more funny and in a lively way we can add audios also we can add videos also we can give different logos also everything whatever we want we can use it here so it's a very good tool in which we can do the assessment once the deadline will be over student will not able to get login again and then they will you will understand that what will happen it will give it results there and then also there is one limitation which i think here is that student can cheat from the online but it is okay if they cheat also nakal ke liye bhi akal ki zarurat hai at least they will go and they will see to it and they will understand ki ha nakal ke liye kuch dhoondenge to sahi and at least they will do that which is important that they are at least doing something they are going for this thing and you can make it mandatory for the students so like this there is paper free hassle free and they can use it as per the deadlines you will give to them i hope this is clear to us i have given a demonstration of it it's very easy to do it otherwise i am available in the faculty room if anybody wants i can help them in making such worksheets i am going i am planning such worksheets for corporate communication and still photography also any questions so this this was my today's uh, thing i have learned about it so i think i think that i thought that my peer should also understand kuch aisa kare to shayad students hamari classes ko seriously le le